Hi y'all, bonjour, hola, my name is Trish. If you're new, welcome. I wanna show you how to create a quick and easy text line effect in Photoshop. Shall we begin? Go ahead to your shape tool, pick up your rectangular shape tool, and we are going to go ahead to draw our first rectangle like this. It can be outside the box, doesn't matter. Go under your property, click on your fill, choose the color black we want to make a copy so command j to make a copy just pull it down to the distance that you want select both lines and make another copy command j so we are just going to make duplicate notice that photoshop is keeping the distance that you did for the first one now i'm going to click on all four hold down shift while i have selected the first one Make a selection of the last one, command J, make a copy. So you just repeat this. Now we want to make a selection of all of our lines. So click on your top line, scroll all the way down, hold down shift, select the last line, right click and convert all your shapes to a smart object. We want to apply the liquify effect. You want to click on the line, go to filter, choose liquify. Now Photoshop brings up this dialog box and you want to make sure you pick up your forward warp tool. Now go ahead and create some swells in your line just like that. And now you see that it gives you a preview while you do it. So you can actually create the swell on the entire um, document. So when you move your font in different locations, the effect still shows up. Now I'm gonna go ahead to click OK. We wanna clip our layer to our font. So hold down option, clip in between line image layer and your font. And you notice that that effect have been applied to your font, but we cannot see it because our text is also black, just like our line. So we're going to double click on our text and change the color. So pick up your type tool, highlight your fonts, flip your foreground and background color. And there you go. You have this cool line text effect. Now you can move it in different directions to get the desired effect. The other thing is that you can also change your font. If I want a different text, I can go ahead and change it. Please give this video a thumbs up. Bye, y'all.